Hello, welcome to our world culture segment of this month. Today, we will be presenting you five facts about Mexico that you probably don't know. First fact, the contemporary culture. This is a product of centuries of mixing between indigenous African and Spanish populations during the colonial period. This mixing known as el mestizaje produced a unique cultural identity that makes up the basis of modern day Mexico and can be seen in every aspect of Mexican life, including our food, clothing, art, music, and even the language. Second fact. Mexico is home of the oldest university in North America. The first university was the Royal and Pontifical University of Mexico. The university was founded by the King of Spain in 1551 and was run by the church until the early 20th century. In 1910, the university came under control of the state, becoming a secular institution, and it remains a state run until this day. Later, in the 1920s, it became the Autonomous and adopted the name of National Autonomous University of Mexico. Um, we call it today UNAM. And today it is considered one of the best universities in the world. Third fact, UNESCO has named so many of Mexico's landmarks as World Heritage Site, 35 to be precise making the country in Latin America with the most World Heritage Sites. Some of them include the Asian Mayan Pyramids in Chichen Itza, the Xochimilco Canals in Mexico City, and the Copper Canyon in Chihuahua, the north part of Mexico, among many others. Fourth fact, we have a successful and highly influential film industry. Since the dawn of the film industry, there have been many Mexican filmmakers creating and innovating. Afterwards, after the revolution, um, time became more stable and the advent of the sound in films ushered in the golden age for Mexican cinema. And by the 1940s, Mexico became the largest exporter of Spanish language films in the world. Recently, Mexican film continues to thrive around the world, giving rise to award-winning talents such as Guillermo del Toro, Alfonso Cuarón, and Alejandro González Iñárritu. You might know him for movies like Water, Babel, and Birdman. Fifth and most important, is Cinco de Mayo our Independence Day? No. Contrary to what many people believe, Mexico's Independence Day is not Cinco de Mayo. That was only a battle that we won against France in a, fra in a war that we lost. So our real Independence Day is celebrated today, September 15th and September 16th. Celebrations begin on the eve of the holiday with El Grito, a ceremony commemorating the shout of Dolores in 1810, which gave way to the War of Independence. This is followed by fireworks, music, and dancing. The next day, parades, parades take place in most major cities. Popular foods include pozole, a hearty corn soup, and chiles en nogada. These are stuffed chiles drenched in a nut based sauce topped with pomegranate. As you can see, these have the colors of our flag, green, white, and red. It is also a delicious plate that I highly recommend. So thank you for tuning in for our World Cultures segment. Um, we invite you to subscribe to our channel, to look for us on social media, and of course, uh, visit our website, wachouston.org. Thank you, and until the next time.